Hello, this is Aiden EI8HTB. Welcome to my channel. I just like to do a little video on um, clamp on PL259 connector for Westflex 103. Now you can get to use these on different coaxes, they all come in different sizes. So, first of all, I'll take this apart. Have or not? Have our atom washer. And then we have our, mm, well, it's a rubber, like a, it's a rubber seal, but also puts the pressure on as well when you tighten up the nut. And here we have our little pieces for the, co for the coax. Now I don't know exactly what the names are off, so and there's a little end piece in this our barrel. So I already have one. Well, I'm in the process of doing one. This is the first time doing these um, plugs. I am used to using other plugs, so I'll just show you how far I'm on on this. So here we go. Right. So it looks okay so far. First of all, what I done was. If I can just get a zoom in on that. Okay, first of all, what I done was I cut an inch off my sheeting, the outer sheeting. I cut an inch from this point to the end tip, an inch. So I cut off that. I took off the sheeting. Then I came along and I put a little nick on the inside it's only a few mil it leaves it easier for this this insert here to go into it okay so few mil will say three mil but one on this side and one on the other side then what i do is i came along and i put this washer first of all down over my bread so that's it there and then I came along and then I folded over the braid over that. And then after that, but of course, now I had to put on, I had to put on this and I had to put on this other washer. Okay, beforehand, before I was doing any of this. Then I came along, once I had this one down and the braid folded back over it, I came along and I pushed this by down into it. There we go. Now, so we still have this inner bit, the, um, the center core, should I say. So now I have this already, I've this already soldered on here. Um, I have the tip of it already soldered on. But before I done that, I just left it about two mil, about two mil up say three mil two to three mil up on the inner part and then cut off that the sheeting as well on the inner and then just took that took that off so i was ready to go and put this on and then i soldered it now I, with them measurements it it was it was perfect i had enough it was just right at the end of the barrel here so i just had to put me bit of solder on so that's as, as as far as I got, and um, now I have this. This is the other barrel of the one that I'm already doing. So all I have to do is come along and just push that in there. Make sure it goes in flush. Like that. Okay, and then come along. Push up the connector. It actually can be easier to do this off off camera. Now it's size seventeen, so I will. I'll do that off camera. Yeah, so that's done. So I have it all. I do not all tightened up. If I can just get that to zoom, and I have it all soldered. 
a little bit of a shine on there from the camera but I, I did just forget there to mention about about the file there is a file on it when you peel back the bread um, you just nick that the, nick the file off careful not to damage the the center core the sheeting of the center core so um, that concludes the video I say 7-3 and uh, don't forget there to give a, a thumbs up and and subscribe so 7-3 from EI8HJB